That was Van Jones narrating an excerpt of the film A Fierce Green Fire, which tells the history of the environmental movement for more than the past half century and airs tonight on PBS American Masters. We're joined by its director, Mark Kitchell. Mark, that story, the Greenpeace chapter, if you will, is one of five in this film, which you call A Fierce Green Fire. Why? Oh, there's a famous story. It happened about a century ago in um, a young ranger named Aldo Leopold, uh, whose job was to kill predators. He uh, shot a wolf, and he went down the hill to see uh, a fierce green fire in her eyes as she was dying. And that was his awakening. And uh, he wrote a famous essay about it called Thinking Like a Mountain. Uh, but for us, um, we think of a fierce green fire as the movement, the environmental movement, and that's the way we use it in the film. And uh, that's what we were really trying to do in this film that makes it different from other environmental films that are more issue driven. We were really looking to uh, tell stories of the movement, and uh, we thought it would be a more engaging and impassioned. Uh, approach to what are very difficult subjects. You know, usually environmental films, no matter how good they are, are an eco-bummer. Uh, it's always about a problem and a crisis, and uh, it ends with a plea for help. And this, we thought people could really identify with people like Lois Gibbs and Paul Watson and really get the passion. And these people succeeded against enormous odds, and that should give us some kind of hope that we can deal with such overwhelming problems like climate change and the sixth great extinction and trying to create a sustainable revolution um, to save human society.